and welcome to Cactus Caffeine. For today, I have some early bloomers for all of you. So these are either Soko Rebusha or Rebusha. So I've been doing a Winter 2021 flower series in Instagram and in my Facebook accounts. If you've been following there, these are some of the flowers that I've been featuring. But for today, I decided to show this also in YouTube because I am aware some of you told me that you don't have an Instagram nor a Facebook account. So you've been missing out on some of my flowering or short flowering videos. So let me start off with this cactus right here with yellow flowers. This is a Soko Rebusha. And the name of this cactus, I will flash flash it on the screen because I don't know how to pronounce it. But this is a very attractive flower. It produces yellow spines or brown spines and yellow flowers. So this is a clumping cactus. In time, it forms many offsets, as you can see here, or pops around the mother plant. And if you want to propagate this cactus, you can simply take off one of the offsets when it is big enough and root them separately. Okay, so very attractive and it's also a heavy bloomer. As you can see, there's more buds on the way, but this is just these are just the first ones that open up for today. This second one right here, this is a Rebusha. So this is called Rebusha cultivar mandy okay so this one is a surprise for me so this is fairly new this was given to me by a viewer last year and as far as i was concerned i thought this was still rooting and it has been overwintering in my garage but i was surprised when it produced a flower the very first flower and wow i can say this is the most attractive rebusha flower that i have in my collection if you can see i um could see three colors so there's three colors that blends in this flower the outer petals are pink and then as you go towards the center it turns into salmon and then orange okay so very very beautiful and um i tried to look this up online there is not much information about this cactus so i am guessing it is a fairly or pretty new cultivar all i found out was this could be a rebusha heliosa cultivar all right so again this is rebusha cultivar mandy and then the last cactus that I have for today back there, this one is a Rebusha miniscula. So this has been blooming since December and I don't think it ever went into winter dormancy <laughs> because it has been blooming all winter. And now that it is almost spring, it is producing a lot more buds. So I am excited when all these buds start to open and I would probably make another video featuring this cactus. All right, here is the update guys. Three days after, more flowers from this Rebusha miniscula open today. Very beautiful. This Rebusha has uh, rather larger flowers than the rest of my Rebusha. And then... Um, the Soko Rebusha flowers, the others have closed now and I still have one, but there's more buds forming around it. And then this Rebusha Mandy is still open. Nice. All right. So if you like my video, guys, give me a thumbs up. And if you like to know more about cactus and other desert plants, don't forget to subscribe to this channel. Until next time again, bye everyone and cheers